Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Hypermind Vanilla Season 5. I hope you're doing well. I'm doing well. I'm down here in the mines, and I'm not quite sure what exactly we're going to get into today in this episode. We might go to the nether, but to get to the nether, we need to do a little bit of prep work. We need some more materials, especially in the armor department. And one of the best ways to get armor, one of the best types of armor, is diamonds. Yep, I've, I've been doing some mining, and I found a lot of diamonds, but I've left them here until we got the Fortune 3 pick. And now that is available. So let's turn around here, shall we? Pull up the F1 screen, and I'm going to show you off camera. I went back to the grindstone and... Uh, checked out a few things and hopefully we don't have a I hear a skeleton rattling around and I hope he's not going to surprise me I think I've got everything locked up but but yeah so uh, since we were last together I've gotten some more levels and I removed the fortune 2 unbreaking 3 and eventually cycled around to this one I've still got the efficiency 4 up in the house the starter house but we've got this one so i'm going to go around and we're just going to do a quick uh, you know a little montage here and i'm going to uh, fortune up all of the fortunable ores that i have left uh, in and around these mines so far so um, put your comments down or put a comment down in the uh, below the video to see how many diamonds i get and the other resources that I happen across and we'll see you on the other side Well, we're back from the, that little mining montage. We'll see how that ends up going. I haven't edited it yet, so I don't know. Uh, when we got back up here, it was nighttime, so yeah, I had to... Oh, well, we've got some visitors around. We just do we, we don't want to hang out with them so much. But do you have your guesses ready? What do you think I got? Okay, three, two, one... There we go. That's the results of just those corridors that I had left uh, for the most part. The coal probably could have gotten more, but I did need to get coal as I was doing that mining off camera. Uh, yeah, so not as much coal as we might would have assumed, but yeah, bunch of lapis, bunch of redstone. That's going to come in handy coming up with especially the witch farm project. But then look at the diamonds, all of the diamonds, even some that I discovered as I was mining out the other things. So yeah, almost two stacks of diamonds. And that means we'll be able to put together our full diamond gear. So let's, uh, let's take all of this out of here and we'll get the, oh, steak. Mm, yummy. Uh, let's put that iron ore in here. I guess that means there's more steak 
all around. That's good. We need the XP. Don't I don't know if there there is an XP farm. It's close to spawn. And guess what? I am not close to spawn. So uh, we're going to have to make do for now with what we've got. Let, let's jump up here. Oh my goodness. Up, 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 up. There we go. Okay, we'll go put the redstone up here in the treasure chest. And then the diamonds. Yep. And how much iron we got. Okay. So there is one thing I want to do. And let's get some... Get a gold ingot uh, set up here. And... What I want to do is make some golden boots because uh, we're going to need to go to the nether. I did pr say that we're going to go to the nether, so that probably means that I'm bound for it. But I am not excited about the nether in this update. Not at all. It is raining. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see if anyone needs the rain. Do I have... I, I may have turned chat settings back on. Yep, shown. Oh, the noise. Let, at, let's at least put down the noise. Okay, and we'll try not to look outside oh God, that just messes me up anyway let's get some gold armor Ooh, protection for depth strider three that's a good pair of boots i like that if we had feather falling four that would just put it over the top but beggars can't be choosers so let's let's do this what do we got on that one and then how about over on a pick to see if we can silk touch efficiency four that would be Good, another efficiency four pick. Okay. Um. And do we have any? You know, I I I haven't brought you along for this early game stuff in quite a while, so do bear with me, please. No, not a diamond sword yet. Uh, let's do this, and then uh, let's put away some more of our stuff. Yeah. So we've come back from the mining, and I did not go ahead and put away all of this fun stuff here. Granite, don't need that. Diorite, don't need that. Uh, flint, yeah, okay. Andesite, good. Gravel, we've got gravel right here. All right, so we've got plenty of room now. I'm going to keep eating on the cooked pork chop for now, and we'll switch to steak when... I'm done with this. So I've got gold boots. Let's see if we can make the rest of the armor, shall we? Uh, gold boots for when we go to the nether because there's going to be the piglins and they're going to be kind of rough if I don't have, yeah, if I don't have the some, some piece of gold on me. So I'm going to go with the boots for now and we'll see what kind of enchantments we can get. Not so good right now. Unbreaking blast protection. That'd be good. Let's go for that. Blast protection, unbreaking three. What do we got here? Oh, and I don't have enough XP. So we're going to have to wait on that. Um, yeah, so for now, what I want to do is uh, I need to go off camera and prepare a bit, get ready for going to the nether, and then we're going to have to get another portal, which means I need to go collect some more obsidian. And what do we got on here? Efficiency four. Hmm. That's that's going to be all right right there. Okay. So I'm going to go off camera for a, a, a little bit. Uh, it might be a, a bit for you or a short amount of time. It's going to be a little while for me until the next time we record, but that's fine. And hopefully in that time, I get some more XP. I can get this diamond armor going and I'll get the nether portal stuff together and we'll see what we can do or see where we end up over in the nether. All right. So I will see you in a little bit. Well, ladies and gentlemen, to say that I am not excited about this next part would be an understatement. So we're going to stall for a bit. I've got 30 levels, got a diamond sword, and it says that Smite 4 has shown up. Let's see what else we got. Smite 4 and Unbreaking. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. 
we're going to put this one away. We're going to grab the gold boots and replace those. And you see in my inventory, we've got some obsidian. And uh, I want to put away, we're going to put away that fortune pick right there. And we'll put away those boots probably. Mm. I'm going to go in with just gold boots for now. And, uh, you know, if something bad should happen, uh, we're, we're only losing iron armor. So, so, yeah, anything else I should leave? Silk touch pick. Not too keen on losing a silk touch pick. So, let's put that away also. Bring an iron pick. Stone shovel. We're not going to need a bed. And blocks on the bar. We don't need the water bucket. We do need to make a flint and steel so we'll grab that and then let's come up here and maybe grab uh, let's throw the wood up here it's a little bit of organizing since we were last together and yeah let's get some cobblestone i think that'd be good sticks we'll put those away hopefully we won't need them and crafting table shouldn't need that all right so we've got a decent enough sword and uh, sufficient armor. Okay. So what we're going to do now is go down here. I got tired of having to run through the uh, the darkness if I was coming up from the mines. And so I built this little tunnel. It takes me over to, and you, you can hear, we've got a zombie hanging around somewhere. It takes me over to our ladder right here. Instead, what I want to do is bring up F3 and G, and I want to chunk align this thing uh, because I want it to be as close to a multiple of eight as possible. Uh, we've got we've got somebody close by. Let's. I probably shouldn't be using this iron pick. Let's bring up F3, and we'll see in the chunk fifteen. Six, five, four. Okay, so we're almost on a chunk boundary right here. Yeah, there we go. So that's a chunk boundary. Let's keep this fairly safe. Let's come over to this side and chunk seven, eight. Okay, so we'll go right here. And we're at a pretty high Y, 58. Uh, eh, it's all right, I guess. And let's give ourselves a little bit of room. Okay. And eight, eight, nine. Okay. Let's put it right here. So we'll do that and get some light on the subject. All right. So we got that. Let's go up into the ceiling. We need height of a little bit more. And one more. That should be sufficient, right? Let's get rid of F3. And yes, I am not going to fill in the corners. I know that's a thing uh, that people want to be uptight about, but I'm not going to worry about it. Let's clean out around here just in case we have any issues with coming back through the portal and getting stuck because it is a snapshot. All right, so I've got obsidian, I've got flint and steel, I've got half a stack of steak. All right, here we go. And we'll see 1.16 nether for, oh, what? Oh no, oh no, mm, okay. Well, uh, that means that I'm in uh, quite the wrong place. So, hmm, I have I have hooked up to somebody else's portal. Uh, not not cool. Not cool. It means I'm close to the mesa. I need to figure out where the next portal should be, and that means that I'm going to be stuck way far away. I'm hmm, not too keen on this. I need to go off camera. I've got to go back to my my area.
get some more obsidian and put a portal in the location that uh, is a little bit closer. So I'll see you. Well, you know what? Let's go into the Mesa. Okay, we can do that. And let's get rid of chunk order, shall we? Okay, we got a uh, one of those things. What are they called? Pillager outpost over there. It's from the 1.14 update. Yeah, nice. Okay. Well, I've got to get back home, and uh, I don't know exactly where home is. So I will see you in just a little bit when we're going back through the nether. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I am back at home. I realized that we got this advancement on the way. And yeah, we got 10 minutes before the server restarts. So I am very thankful that I picked up the, or I had the F3 screen going on our last section. I went back and watched the video. So now we get to do a little math. So let's, let's see. Hopefully OBS did not just freak out there with uh, opening up the calculator. So we've got to define where do we want this next portal? And it looks like we're obviously on the roof of the nether already. Uh, let's get away from this portal, shall we? Uh, because, my goodness, that is loud. So let's go back over here. So the way that it works in the nether is that you take your X and Y coordinates, you divide by eight. Because every block you move in the nether, you move eight in the overworld. So we were at, uh, let's let's go back and get the exact, the exact one that I want to focus on. So that's 2318, negative 3207, right? Right, that's what we want. Okay, so that means we're going to divide 2318 by 8. And I've got calculator up over in another window. So that would be 289.75. We're going to round up and say 2, 290. Okay. And then I clear that out. Negative 3207 divided by, and this would be 8 again. And that is negative 400.875. So we're going to say negative 401. All right. So that is the coordinate that we need or coordinates that we need in the nether. I'm going to keep F3 up for now. Okay. And let's go through here. We'll go back to the Mesa portal on the roof of the nether. Lovely. Lovely. Okay. And let's see what direction we need to go. 290. So this is negative 401. That's increasing Z and decreasing in the x so yeah let's go 290 here we go 290 and then this direction and we'll go to negative 401 i love the new sounds in the nether it's very different very different than before now i didn't bring with me any slabs to cover the top of our portal but yeah here we go we're almost almost here oh wait too far too far negative 401 and we'll look at targeted block 290 here we go all right so i should have sufficient obsidian for this okay and yeah we're going to cheap out on the corners here as well okay and now if we put a light that should keep us from having any surprises right drop down and we'll put uh, we'll light that up let's see if we get through to my portal back home Okay, sure enough. All right, that means that the next order of business is to put a sign on it to let people know that it is mine. Okay, so we'll come back up here. And we'll go up. Uh, let's close that in. We can get rid of the F3 screen. Hopefully, we get back to where we're expecting to get back to. 
So, I haven't done much in the way of projects or anything, but that was quite an unexpected adventure there to get uh, this portal set up. You know what? I should probably bring a... Oh, what is it? A crafting bench. Or at least some... Yeah, I, we'll, we'll do a crafting bench. Uh, no, can't. i got to close that. Do we have any cobblestone slabs? That'll be good. Maybe a few more. Okay. We'll do that. And yeah, we'll go back down. So never leave home without your crafting bench. Did I have it with me the entire time? Where did I put it? I put it up in the wood chest, didn't I? Yeah, let's do that. Uh, there, there. Check all the things. There we go. Okay, so we got that. Lapis Lord just joined. I've got chat turned off per usual. Again, uh, you never know what people are going to say. Sorry, guys. But if you're wondering, why is this so, so uh, antisocial? Well, well, that's why. You got to keep the channel clean, and chat doesn't always stay clean. So. All right. I ended up back where I was expecting, so we're going to say soaps. Okay? And we'll make this a little more convenient for everyone. Not that I really want them coming through at this point, but hey, you do what you gotta do. Let's go up top here. And we definitely don't want anything spawning. And given the light level conditions for piglins and zombie piglins and everything else they've added i don't know all right so we're here in the nether uh not uh, i i really don't know what um or where to go from here uh we were obviously not below and that's kind of where i wanted to get to and i would like to go to spawn and i don't know where spawn is so i will have to maybe walk around a bit and see if I can find spawn. All right. So I, maybe that's the next objective. We'll try and get back to spawn and see if we can do some shopping. So I'm going to go back through here, get my uh, funding and, and then, yeah, we'll try and find spawn. Um, and when I do, I'll bring you back and hopefully the server will have restarted by that point. Back in a bit. All right, here we go. We've got an up. Yep, okay. And down. Okay, well, here we go. Okay, that's not so bad. Let's uh, let's take a look around. Lapis said, look for the sugar shack on the outskirts of town. And when I was looking from up top there, where, how do I get back, by the way? Okay, it's up there. So we've got our portal to the main section of the nether. Right? Mr. Pigglesworth. Okay. It's not the Pigglesworth I know. Switch it off. I don't have a clear glass texture pack. We'll go through and take a look at that forthwith. But I saw a sugarcane farm over here. Melon blocks. Well, we don't need those right now. Okay, that's all well and good. Axes, shovels, pickaxes. Yeah, it looks like I'm in the right spot. Mending? Oh, yes. And a site. Melon blocks, no slices. Let's see. Price can be paid in multiple ways. Welcome to... Okay. Carrots, potatoes, melon blocks, pumpkins, granite, diorite. Regular stone. Just check the prices in the next tab. Tools. Okay. Armor. Fine. Enchantments. Choose one. 48. Carrots, taters, melon blocks, pumpkins, 48 stone. That's it. 
Okay. Armor, 64. So stack of carrots or potatoes. Stack of melon blocks or pumpkins. Stack of any of the stone blocks. Okay. Enchantments are 48. Okay. So that's doable. Not right now, though. Because I brought these two. But uh, I didn't bring any of that. So mending. What do we got? Fortune 3. Silk touch. Okay, that's all well and good. Looting. That'd be good to have on this sword. So we will need to come back later. But that's an interesting pricing scheme. And I'll take it. I'll take it. That means that we need to do some mining. All right. So that is the sugar shack. Okay. Cool. Cool. I can, I can get behind that. And then, let's see, anything else I need to take a look at over here? I know there's a mini game that Benito put together. And let's see, what do we what do we have? Does he provide all the stuff for it? Benito's redstone shop. Don't need redstone right now. How about this? Okay, for the arrows in the chest. Also some bows. Okay. Send on the pressure plate to activate the game and fire away. The shot has to be accurate on the target, not just hit. So I guess a target block appears. And you might get a prize. You know what? Let's do it. Okay. So we will put a diamond in. Bow and eight arrows. Okay. Aha. Okay, I see. I see how it goes. Okay. I'm doing terrible at this. Too late. Yep, too late there. Okay. So, let's put another diamond in there. Now we've got the idea of the game. Okay. All right, we'll hold back a bit and go. Did not get it that time. I'm too slow. Oh, and I'm out. Okay, I think that's going to be it for now. We'll put the bow back. I think that's how we do that. Shot has to be test your skills before you challenge. Just keep me the game close. Eight. One diamond for eight shots against the target. Each accurate shot, you win a prize. Yeah. Not so good at that. Okay. So I've paid for two rounds. Maybe we'll come back later. But right now we're just taking a look at what's going on in spawn. So the ring road is continuing to go in. And that's, yeah, that's an ongoing project. I don't know who's doing that, but it's coming along. Got part of it up to here and then what we got up this way you see somebody's doing a mega build over there zombie farm um yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna stay away from that for now whose is this this is nice modern design or futuristic design okay and a sign future site of the All Mall. So maybe there will be some shops available in here. Okay. Nice. And rocket shop over here maybe. Let's see what else. There's been a lot of activity. A lot of people uh, are able to play more frequently than I am. So it's neat to see the town, town center has... Oh, coming soon. Okay, cool. What do we got here? All right. Well, there we go. That's sorry. I should be reading while I'm out of practice with the, doing this stuff. Horse pen made by Lapis. Okay. And then this one. We kind of just skimmed through here. Boom's house made by Doom. 
Okay. And what's this one? Community house. Oh. Close, close that. Okay, so someplace we can come. Oh. Hi. Food, glorious food. Is there raw fish? Maybe I should fish some of that up over at the witch hut. Uh, and over here. Okay, it goes out to the back of that. Inspection failed. How about this one? Holy Honey Temple, which looked like a mob farm when I was up on the Nether Portal Island. Here's some llamas around us. Again, JB's humble abode. Humble abode indeed. It's missing a roof. Maybe the building inspector should come by. Do I still have a sign? No, I got rid of those. All right. It's probably time to head back. Maybe we'll go into the nether proper and see what's going on. I don't have a clear glass texture pack, but I think... I think that's what we should try next. Okay, let's go through here. Yep. Going in. All right. Wish me luck here. Okay. Oh my goodness. That's uh, that's not formidable at all. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. Wow. Well, good job, Jan. Oh, and that noise, the ambient noise. Hopefully that can come through in the recording. But, hmm, I hear something. I think it's the very things that I'm most concerned about in the nether update. I need to get out into that area. We're going to have to get some black stone. But for now, let's go back. And we'll go up to the tower and get back to the witch hut uh, that way. How do we do that? That is right there. We'll go get into here. Okay. We'll go back into the nether and we will sign off from here. Hopefully you have enjoyed. Let's turn around here and say, uh, pull off the armor just so you can see the skin there. Hopefully you've enjoyed. It's been kind of a rambly, a walkie-talkie bit, but um, hey, we got to the nether. Um, not quite the way I was intending, but hey, what are you going to do? Um, we'll see about getting down into the nether proper. I may do that off camera, but I need to collect some of the black stone that was there around, or that's in this biome right here. Anyway. Uh, enough chit chat hopefully you enjoyed let me know what you want to see next but uh I, I can tell you what i'm going to be doing off camera i got to collect some some blocks because i need mending books and lots of them and uh so that means we're going to be doing a lot of mining i'm going to do that off camera and well we got some plans for things to get into next but i'm not going to reveal those for now hopefully you enjoyed we'll see you next time Bye bye